Alrighty, uh, let's go ahead and play this here game. Uh, an uh, another point of note that I forgot in my intro, uh, this is a console game, so it's there's a possibility of my voice being unsynced from my webcam. You know, I will continue to monitor this as it develops. Also, uh, the sound might be off a little bit, but I can... Uh, um, I can figure that out as I go because it's a console game and I have that capability. Um, if you, you know, do I have to ex explain? Um, uh, my difficulty settings, you know, it, people should know by now. I don't want to challenge or I don't want a, a struggle. Just want to have some some fun, you know. Uh, we are not the tools of any higher power. Each of us is the very embodiment of free will. Even so, there comes a time in every man's life when he must answer a call to destiny beyond human understanding. How will you respond to that moment when that moment strikes you? Truly, nothing is more awe-inspiring than one who unceasingly pushes himself beyond the threshold of his courage and will. I had hoped to embody such an ideal uh, myself. Even now, many decades later, my awe for her remains unwavering. Uh, Adel Christian. Preface to the travelogue of the Get Sea. Or something. Like my webcam is the biggest it's ever been. Probably want to lap that down a little bit. That's better. <laughs> Actually, it's not the biggest it's ever been. <laughs> I watched uh, my Deus Ex Mankind Divided playthrough. Uh, a few weeks back and uh, you know let's just say that's the biggest it's ever been <laughs> hey do Christian very much a Falcom nameplate introduction Yo, uh, you taking a break too? all right uh I really want to press options I just heard voice acting, and I could barely hear it. Look, fool, get this out of my way. Woo, what a nice breeze. believe how suffocating it gets in the cargo hold. Gotta say, that uniform looks pretty good on you. Awfully nice of them to let us hitch a ride to Aresia in exchange for work. They got me moving cargo around and you helping out as a sailor on this voyage. They're even paying and feeding us too. Pretty sweet deal if you ask me. How do we thank the captain? I know they're feeding us, but we should save up while we can. True words were never spoken. Adventuring isn't cheap. I certainly don't need to tell you that. Anyway, once we dock, we'll be on our way to the next stop on our journey. I'm a little sad we gotta say goodbye to Xandria. But there's no time to be moping when adventure's waiting for us. I'm looking forward to it, buddy. Uh, I increased the volume, but that might be the death of me. I think the just the voice acting is incredibly low. Because I even have my volume kind of high. So, Adel, what is our next stop anyway? Wow, Adel. Is that the, uh, the, the official? 
Hey, I'm the Overlord. Yep. He's eight for me. Once we dock in Sunyu, Greek is just around the bend. Uh, wherever the wind may take us, that's just how it all works. <laughs> what, are you a poet now? Or are you trying to talk like Luta? If you ask me, I would have preferred heading west, along the coast of Africa. Whoa, whoa! Are you guys voyaging to Altago? Altago. Ah, oh, Kathy! Kathy? What an interesting name. <laughs> you bet we are. Adol has always been looking for a way to get to Altago. Unbelievable. You do know about the conflict between the Kingdom of Altago and the Roman Empire, don't you? Roman Navy vessels are pretty much the only ships that can enter that region of the sea. <laughs> Heard that you're an adventurer. That just seems reckless. Yeah, well, there's never a dull moment when I'm tagging along with this guy. Adel can't walk more than three steps without stepping in some kind of adventure. What do you say, Kathy? You like tagging along too? <laughs> Thanks, but I'll pass. Anyway, you two, break time's almost over. These are very much Trails of Cold Steel models. And in, in style. Dogi, not so much, but everyone else so far. Dogi, I need you to get back to work in the cargo. I'm just trying to get past this part so that. I can actually access the settings. Back on the clock already, huh? No problem. I'll head down right now. Catch you later, Adol. Um. Oh, I don't, I don't like these. What should I do is the best possible option here, because maybe he'll just say, eh, just relax. Go see Captain Barbaros. He told me to send you to his quarters once your job is finished. Oh no. You're putting text boxes over here? Oh no. The captain's quarters can be found at the quarter deck, near the stern of the ship. Alright, move. Stuff. Uh, Target lock, unlock, jump, attack, talk, switch, bitch. Fishing. Oh boy. Change ally tactics. Alright, well, we can worry about that later. Downloadable content. You know what I want to do? I want to access the system settings, the options, uh, sound. Let's see here. Voice all the way, sound effects. Let me turn down the music for myself here. I think the music sounds okay so far. Let's uh, put that down there. All right, man, you need to stop talking. You're talking too much. My goodness. Down for myself again. Uh. Um, loading screen tips, enemy statuses, indicators, item log, mini map, LOS. Uh, turn on to display line of sight indicator on mini map. Sure, I don't know what that means. Um, 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 battle attack correction. Detection range. Do not want that. Text speed. Let's go fast for now. Auto text. Uh, let's do this for events. Auto text speed. Go fast, I guess. 
difficulty, we keep that the same. Okay, I think, uh, ooh, save anywhere? Save anywhere. All right, back on the clock already, huh? Yup. It's Monday. It's, it's Yeezy time. Hmm. Oh, I thought he was actually going to talk. Uh, what a massive ship. Been a while since I was last on one this big. I wanted to hit the head, uh, but I took a wrong turn somewhere. Too bad this ain't my ship, or I'd just whiz off the deck. Gah ha ha. <laughs> hmm. What it, is, is my controller just not, not operating correctly here? Uh, leads below deck in the captain quarters. Are we going to have some problems, controller? Yes. There are various important passengers in this room. The captain told me not to let anyone through. So if you're on patrol, please go somewhere else. Bearing north, northeast! Engage! Oh, I'm blocking a little bit of the mini-map. I think I'm okay with that. Yeah. Weather's been great lately, and the water's been calm. It's rare to have such a steady voyage. Could it be that you and Dogie are good luck charms? Ah, uh, ah, uh, you don't, you don't know us too well. Yeah, yeah. Ain't easy being yees. Ah, <laughs> uh, the Lombardia is a pretty nice ship. It's way more exp. Uh, it's a more expensive ship than what I usually take, but I'm not taking any chances. I have a big business uh, meeting at the Union. I, I feel like they pronounce that differently. Uh, and I gotta close the deal. Uh, so I was briefly looking at the, the intro to this game. There's all kinds of crazy spoilers and in intros, so you know, I didn't wanna look into it too much. But I think some of these people on this ship are party members. I thought it would be fun if I went to, uh, with my dad to his work. Everyone was just sucking up to each other. It was sad. Uh, how boring. Marlene said, uh, go to the stern of the ship. Look, man, I go where I want. <laughs> Today is a perfect day for a voyage. All is God's will. Would you like to pray with me? Not a chance. Go forth to the Get Sea. Or Gete. Or Gate. Um, hey, it's you, Adol. Are you patrolling? Oh, just looking for the captain. I think you already know that the captain's room is in the back. Hey, Adol. Hey. Hey. Uh... The the Get Sea has always been a real prosperous maritime trade route. That's why outlaws tend to target ships for their cargo. You know, pirates. The Lombardia is a passenger ship, but it has some nice cannons as a countermeasure. Well, it's for the safety of the passengers, too. Alrighty. I think I spoke to everybody. This, uh... Run animation? Is... Weirdness. Okay, let's go see the captain. Monsieur Capitan. Ah, Adol. Thank you for coming. Please have a seat. I we'll want to change the text speed. A little crazy. As I recall, you introduced yourself to me as an adventurer. Tell me, do you know of the Isle of Salem? No. Understandable. The Gate to Sea is home to many islands, after all. She's a treacherous sea to navigate. More ships than I can count have run afoul of her jagged islands. But the Isle of Saren has a particularly fearsome reputation. 
for you see, every ship that approaches the island sinks by some mysterious happenstance. Is that... <laughs> this ship is en route to the island's surrounding waters as we speak. That being said, I intend to keep us a safe distance from the island. About five years ago, a Roman vessel conducting an exploratory voyage approached the island. The sea was calm that day, and ran afoul of nothing. Yet I heard it was pulled under all the same. Grecian mythology speaks of monsters called Sirens, which lure ships to their doom. The pirates who first discovered that island declared it cursed ground, and named it accordingly. Is there any way to go to shore? Maybe. Hmm. I didn't expect you to ask that. Unfortunately, no one alive knows the answer to that question. The unlucky ones who have set foot on the island were never seen or heard from again. Even the saltiest sailors to voyage the gate to sea could tell you nothing about the island. I'd at least like to see it. I cannot approach the island, but when we pass by it, I will let you know. It seems my tale did not but stoke the fires of your adventurous spirit. I share this tale with every new member of my crew. When I first told Cathy, he was so frightened that he refused to leave his quarters. But I see you're made of sterner stuff than he, lad. If you say so, sir. No. So humble. I respect that. I am sitting down. Now then, I'm sorry to keep you so long. I have a favor to ask you. I insist on holding a small welcome party whenever new passengers come aboard. I want you to attend the party and provide security. Aren't I a passenger on this ship? You want me to... Uh, attend the party and... You know, have some drinks, eat some food, meet some people, but you also want me to protect these people? Who's this party for, if it ain't for me? Are you worried about something? Huh? Don't worry. I'm merely being cautious. As captain, it's my responsibility to ensure that every passenger aboard my ship is safe. Please, speak to Kathy for the details about your assignment. I know you won't let me down at all. This is by far the best ship I've ever been on. Great to it. Yes, I mean, right? I've been. I've been all It's a perfect getaway. I tell you. Are you new first time? First time on board? Hey, look at this guy. Come on. Good evening, passengers. I'm Captain Barbaros. I'd like to take this opportunity to thank you choosing the Lombardia for your seafaring needs. With four masts, and at 50 melia in length, this vessel is the largest of the passenger ships that voyage between Zandria and Aresia. All right, Edo. Since you're providing security, let's go over your responsibilities. Need you to patrol the passenger compartment and the main deck. Keep a close watch for any passengers who seem suspicious or dangerous. How long do you want me to patrol? Let me think. Just patrol until I give you the go-ahead to stop. If you see any interesting guests, feel free to chat them up. But don't forget that these people are our guests, so please be respectful toward them. Aye aye, sir. Well, aren't you enthusiastic? Anyway, it looks like the captain's almost done with the speech. I'll do my part and start patrolling the cargo hold. We'll meet up later, Adol. Yeah, the cargo hold. Yeah, you know, I'm just gonna go rest in the car- I mean, I'm just gonna go patrol the cargo hold. Anyway, that's enough out of me. Please feel free to mix and mingle among yourselves as we continue on our voyage. I bid you all a wonderful evening. Life has changed since you fixed your mic. It's a game changer. I'm happy for you, Dante. Because you desperately needed... Uh... 
to figure out something with your mic. Um, maybe not in the streaming department, or maybe not even, you know, like the bars department either, but um, it's just nice to, to see progress. It's, it seems like it's making you happy as well. Yeah. Yup. Oh, hey, old patrol duty, huh? Doesn't happen often, but we sometimes have stowaways. I'll be careful. Adults who get excited over a party are idiots. I'm getting bored. I should check out the hold. Good thing I made it on board, but where are those darn fools? Uh, if I'd known what was... If I'd known what was going to happen, I'd have picked a spot to rendezvous beforehand. You're suspicious. Uh, seems like we eat while standing. I assume that means we can eat all we want. Alright, I'm going to eat, eat, and eat until I make back the ticket price. Hmm. Looking around, you can tell that all kinds of walks of life are on Lombardia. Different social status, outfits. The ship has an accepting heart. <laughs> Being able to ride a magnificent ship like this uh, made all my long years worthwhile. The food is delicious, too. I have nothing but good things to say. <laughs> Here's to a wonderful night. This claret is quite delicious. There's nothing like a bit of... A nip to round out a hard day's work. This guy is totally suspicious. <laughs> Thanks to my husband, we enjoyed a very nice trip abroad. And now we're heading home on this marvelous ship. I feel like the luckiest girl in all of Aresia. I admit I was a little nervous about traveling by ship. But we had a lovely trip and my wife looks so happy right now, so it was all worth it. Hope this feeling lasts forever. Hmm. La Foppish. Uh, sharing a feast with commoners is more pleasant than I had expected. This blending of unconventional elements has all the makings of a masterpiece. Ah yes, I understand now. There is more to the Lombardia than meets the eye. Uh, to see my mistress so surprised, that was quite the treat. It's my duty as a butler to support my mistress, who is not yet a seasoned traveler. You can be quite a handful. You remind me of, like, Celestin a little bit, but, you know, Celestin's not evil. Uh, there weren't any other ships available, so I boarded this one. I feel really bad for my family. To make up for it when I get back, I'll try to recreate all of the dishes served here for them. With that settled, I need to start my culinary research. Hmm. This wine is the definition of mediocre. You there, what are you just standing there for? You should be bringing me a fine meal. I heard that this was a fine passenger vessel, but it barely reeks of the lower class. Pretty sure it just reeks of you, dog. Husband is cheating on his wife and is smuggling drugs. You can tell from the gentleman title. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> uh, I think you already know about the drinks are for passengers only. But leftover drinks are a very different story. Well, when our shift is up, let's drink like we always do. Wait, 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 wait. Leftover drinks? As in, like, the drinks that they don't finish? I don't think we want to be drinking out of that. We can't afford to relax right now. Hey, sailor, stay out of the way and get a move on. Apparently I'm patrolling more than just the room. You never save too much, people. Someone has spit in all those drinks. Yeah. It, not, not just someone. Everybody. So that's that's generally how how it works when you drink something. Okay. Looks like you're patrolling. Don't tell me you got lost. This is the tail end of the ship. 
the hall and captain's room are over there. If you want to go to the hall, use the stairs at the front of the ship. The the boat is actually swaying right now, and that's that's not good. Main. Oh. Oh, I can look at the. Why is the mini map down here? Can I can I change the position of the mini map? Looks like no. Oh. Before... Uh... We... Continue on with the main quest. Oh, oh. Right, we got... I don't know what that painting is. Oh my goodness. So it begins. <laughs> So it begins. Yes. I've been traveling mostly around the Get Sea, or they said the the Gate Sea, uh, to spread the teachings of the church. My church is based in Greek, and I have not returned to it in two years. I'm sure the children living there have grown so much. You're not from the Greek area. Look forward to seeing them again. You're definitely of a adios style church. All right, come on, there's, there's gotta be a treasure chest or something. Oh, there's another uh, main story thing over here. Oh yeah, you're man in black, you are suspicious. What do you want? Jeez. I don't think. Must not be very busy if you have time to barge into random rooms. By the way, on your way out, make sure you shut the door behind you, quietly. Uh, definitely should have added a soccer at the end of that. Alright, so there's multiple things that I need to do. Why did he have to be on the ship? My word, always treating me like a helpless child. And that is probably a religious zealot. You double check her bags. You gotta be careful with that, Dante. You could pull a gun out on you. And then what? Yes. Then you're dead, and other people are. well, you're dead. Oh, this is the third class cab cabin. We stay here too. Oh, it's you, Adol. I heard you on patrol duty. How's that working out for you? Well, you finish your rounds when you're done for the day. Let's keep at it. Put Captain Solo in the cargo hold. Uh, these loading screens are actually, you know, going through pretty quick for this being on the PlayStation 4. I found the cause of the ship rocking back and forth. Uh. We finally departed. Boarding the ship wasn't my plan. Maybe I should have turned them down. Not like I can hop off midway. I hope I don't have to do anything too demanding. Oh my gosh. Is this Tolvald? Fuck foo. I know it's not Tolvald, but it, it could be Tolvald. <laughs> it's definitely not a, a cow. Uh, everything looks good. No problem passengers either. If anything's going to go wrong, it's apt uh, to happen on the day we weigh anchor. Should be smooth sailing all around, but how about making the rounds anyway? Yo, uh, did, I, did I see a swaying barrel here? Can we tie this down, please? Oh, pick cards. Well, that's what they're supposed to look like, huh? They look like, uh... I don't know. Really fat rats, I guess.
like a, a cat face. Uh, they, honestly, they kind of look like insects to me. Which is weird. No treasure chest. Girl's also not a blonde, even though her title says blonde girl. I wasn't even paying attention to that, actually. Dante paying attention to the important things here. Also, one of those first world problem issues of there's things written on the title or the loading screens, but the loading screens are so fast that I actually can't read anything on the loading screens. How do I... Aha. Where's my fat loot? What's up? Hey, it doesn't seem like you have to pull kitchen duty. What? You're patrolling. Perfect timing, then. I mean, aren't you trying to decide where to go for your next adventure? The ship is gigantic, so I figured we could ask around and hear some interesting stories. If all goes well, we might be able to pick our next destination. If you hear anything interesting, tell me later. Uh, so one of the things is I thought I remember... Um, seeing something or hearing something that this game is a prequel. And so... Since they're mentioning Altalgo... I think this game might be a prequel to um, oh wait that's not what I wanted to do uh, might be a prequel to what's the game ease 7 I was just doing that. All right, point of interest is the blue one. We've got quests, which are other things, and then we got other things. Oh, treasure chests appear on the map. Okay, that's great. Ah, I did not uh, let's see that. I wish I could change the position. I, I would rather the mini map be up in the other corner. The breeze feels nice. Great weather and a clear starry sky. Wait for me, my darling Crete. I'm coming home. The wind is getting stronger! Check our course! Set sail! Wait, aren't, aren't we already setting sail? It was reserved for honored guests. Be a few days before we reach our next destination, so Union Port. I would like to listen to your adventures uh, when we have time. For now, I'll patrol the ship. Your voice coming from the captain's quarters. Oh, this is what a great find too. Now I'm part of the crew too. Have to bust up some suckers. No, oh, it's you. You must be the newbie on board, huh? I may not look it, but I'm actually a pretty seasoned sailor myself. Anyway, I'm gonna report to the captain. Why don't you tidy up or something? Wait a minute. What? You probably can't tell, but I'm very busy. Run away! <laughs> Little girl ran off somewhere. It's a stowaway. Why the heck is Legend of Dragoon a four disc game? 
Come on, Dante. Games back then? That's just how it was done. Final Fantasy VII is four discs, I think, too, isn't it? There's, a, there's, there's quite a few four discs game or four disc games out there. Hey, Adel. How's the security patrol going? Everyone seems suspicious. Really? And we have a lot of interesting people aboard, but I think you're acting a little paranoid. Looks like it's going to be another day of calm waters and smooth sailing. By the way, the captain has been looking for you. I think he said we were about to pass by something soon. He should be back in his quarters by now. Why don't you pay him a visit? Alright, I'll go see him right away. Sounds good, Adel. I'll continue my patrol for a little while longer. Are you actually going to play Legend of Dragoon, uh, Dante? This... Is this actually going to happen? Where are you, little girl? Oh my gosh, I can jump. Where's my... Where's my quick dash? Oh, oh no. They're doing this. Oh no. Let's. Okay, I can. Ah, here we go. Ah, ah. Not very fast, that's for sure. Ah, there you are. I'm sorry to bother you. I understand how busy you are right now. I just wanted to let you know that we're about to pass by it. You mean... That's right, the Isle of Saren. Uh, the sky is clear tonight, so you may be able to see the island's silhouette. The Isle of Saren is about 500 square Crimmel... Uh, Crimmel-y... Crimmel-y... Crimmel uh, the mountain range roughly... Uh, 2,000 milli high stretches across the island center. Since we're about to pass by it, I figured you'd want to see it. Huh? What's happening? I don't know, sir. We seem to have run afoul of something. Impossible. We're in open waters. Assess the situation at once. Aye, aye, sir. <sighs> We're quite a distance from the island. It couldn't be. Ah! Wh what is that? Huh? What's going on? The ship will be destroyed! It's not a JRPG when we're on a boat. And there's no Kraken or ghost ship. Tentacle of the Unknown. Or ghost cracking. Take this. Uh, Isios blade was received and equipped. Look at that! It's got three materia in it too. Alright, X to attack, lock on. The enemy's info and weaknesses will be displayed. Hey! Change targets. Unlock. Ah! 
Uh, press L1 to evade. Use it to avoid dangerous attacks. Aw, oh, yeah, we got Flash Evade. Flash Guard, presumably, is somewhere gonna be around here. Okay, I didn't deserve that. I'm not doing any damage to this guy. Uh, press to jump. Press X while ascending to do a jump attack. Uh, attack again to perform a dive attack. I didn't deserve that. An opening. Well, aren't you a skilled one? Wow, so dashing. That was amazing. Nice work. I can always count on you, Adol. What was that thing anyway? Looked like a tentacle from some kind of giant squid. Everything happens for a reason, remember? Remember none? Someone help me! Oh, come on! Usually they skip this part, you know, and they just go straight to you wash up on shore and you have amnesia. <laughs> so, so I, you know, it's kind of nice to have a little change of pace. Uh, yeah, you need a stream game other than Dark Souls 2 since you're waiting for Krayson to catch up again. Aha. Aha. Well, I look forward to watching you play Legend of Dragoon. I... I hope you let me know before you start streaming it, uh, every single time, you know, because my work schedule allows me to watch streams while I'm working. And, you know, when, when work is slow, I, I need something to, to do. Gonna be starting today. Excellent. Well, after uh, today is not Taco Tuesday, unfortunately. So, you know, I think it's a uh, Burger Monday for me. Although, maybe, maybe, you know what? Maybe I'll go get some Chinese food today instead. 
I need I need to cut down on the, the spending a little bit, you know, because I want to spend a lot of money on uh, Black Friday. But we'll, we'll see how things go, I guess. Yeah, see, a lot of these characters were on on the boat. This is why I suspect a lot of them are party members. Like that guy, he has a weapon. She looks like a party member. See, look at the, the guy in the black hat. Yeah. I see what's going on here. Now right, we're going to recruit a bird as well. As well as a... A... a cow. The... This is why I don't like watching these kind of things, because it's like I don't I don't need to know that that uh, these party members are gonna be here. You know, I, I, let me just let me just have them show up when they show up. Ah, there's a ghost ship right there. <laughs> Looks like we're gonna have a kraken. And the ghost ship. The double header. I'm getting them on there. Oh, they're making that noise. All right, chapter one. 